Bedford College lies in the heart of the town. With more than 18,000 students enrolled, Bedford College has learning centres in Milton Keynes, Rushton, Luton and Bedford. Plus it has a mansion house and even a working farm at Shuttleworth College. But it doesn't stop there. Bedford College plays a big part in the local community by sponsoring and supporting projects such as the Porters Project, the British Waterways Canal Boat, Fresco's work of art, which has inspired art students from the college, and Bedfringe. Bedfringe uh, started in 2007. It's very much a uh, platform for Edinburgh previews and uh, local talent. And in most recent years, uh, Bedford College has been involved and uh, more particularly the uh, venue, the South Pank Art Centre. So we've had an extra venue and also as a result of that we've had a lot of students come in from the college and take part in the festival. Now Bedford College has some fantastic uh, facilities which will uh, prepare the students for a life beyond uh, their study here at Bedford College. This, the facilities are great facilities such as the dance studios, uh, they have a wonderful theatre, uh, TV production studio and of course music recording suites and like I said all of these very unique facilities will perhaps put them one step ahead of maybe other students studying in other colleges in the country. As an outstanding college we wish to be recognised as the leading advocate for learning within the local community. This is achieved with the strong and productive links we have with our partners one of which being the Harper Trust. The Harper Trust is an Elizabethan foundation. Um, our founder, Sir William Harper, uh, was a man of Bedford. He went to London and became Lord Mayor and was very successful. And he wanted to give something back to society. So he bought some land, 13 acres of it, um, with which he endowed his school in Bedford, which turns out now to be Bedford School. The Bedford Sixth Form is in the place where the old uh, high school was. And when we merged our two girls' schools, we no longer needed that building, so we were delighted when the college wanted to take on at least half of it for educational purposes. And that means, for example, that the swimming pool and the sports complex are available still for the people of Bedford, and that's a, that's a good resource for the community, and we're delighted about that. Bedford College has been delighted to project manage the new free school situated in the town. I'm really pleased with how we've done in our first year and we feel certainly on the students we've worked with we've made a significant impact. Bedford College played an integral part in getting the school set up. When we approached them to come in and project manage uh, the school in its pre-opening stages we knew we were working with an organisation that shared our values, that shared our approach to doing things but perhaps more importantly in those circumstances it was an organisation that was able to deliver. We knew they had experience of managing building projects, we knew they had an excellent marketing team and also we knew they had links into the community which we didn't already have that we would be able to use to get out there, explain our message and tell people why we thought we had something to offer the local community. I think the support of Bedford College was absolutely crucial in opening the school. In fact, I think it's fair to say without Bedford College's support, we probably wouldn't be here today. Bedford College is proud to sponsor the Skills Show, which is the UK's largest free event dedicated to career skills and training. The Skills Show is really good for informing young people that there are so many diverse options available to them by giving them the opportunity to see real people who are at the top of their game usually coming out of education, performing against each other, competing to be the best in the country, um, which is hugely inspiring. And as well as seeing these people, you know, really excelling at their skills, they're also able to have a go at the skills themselves and then get advice on how they can pursue a career in that option. Bedford College this year registered um, competitors in five different skills for the World Skills UK portfolio and have been successful in getting two of their competitors to the finals this year. So we're going to have two people competing in um, network infrastructure technician and in plumbing um, as well as that Bedford College are involved in presenting a have a go and a showcase as well as being a premier college sponsoring the skills show. Continuing with education Bedford College along with the Harper Trust also sponsor the Bedford Academy. Both the college and the Harper Trust are major providers of education in Bedford so naturally we have a good working relationship but perhaps the most important thing that we've done together is that we're both sponsors of the Bedford Academy, which is a fabulous new school, £25 million worth of new buildings, fabulous facilities, improving attainment, results improving every year, and above average uh, levels of attendance and behaviour. So we're really very proud of that. And I think, obviously, a lot of that credit must go to 
the staff and the pupils at the academy. But there's no doubt, I think, that the efforts of the college and the Harper Trust have helped with that success as well. With a national reputation for the arts, technology and land-based studies, Bedford College is so much more.